What's up guys? Welcome back to my second ever track vlog. But today we were supposed to have a track meet, but it got cancelled due to the weather. So instead we actually just did a bunch of time trials and some races between our team. Go! Unfortunately for me though, I have not been able to run for the last few weeks because I recently injured my knee. So instead when we were dismissed for school, I went to the weight room and I biked a few miles and also lifted a few weights. Dude, started going out cause that's all he wanted to do. He didn't care about her, just some bottles of booze. He was focused on his last, never told her the truth. Constantly used, grace started fading away. She was giving everything what he would take and take. Her first real love, but for him it was fake. And she finally caught him over at his ex-girl's place. No, she don't know what to do cause loving this guy, that was all that she knew. It's hard to find the next one when you're broken in two. But once I was done with that, I decided to head out to the track and watch some of my teammates races because I want to be a good teammate. I don't put it up to her face Rather cover all the pain before she ever would Say But it turns out I spent way too much time in the weight room Because I missed out on the 4x800 meter race Which according to the people who ran it Was very intense This is an interview from someone Who actually ran the race So basically during the 400 I mean the 800 um, The weather was pretty horrible There was a lot of wind, it was cold It just did horrible but thankfully I was able to watch the 2 mile race, the 1 mile race, the 400 meter race, and I think I might have watched a open 800 race also. So these are just a bunch of clips from uh, the races that went on, as well as some funny moments. Because I have a really funny team, so I hope you all enjoy it. interrupt this vlog for a quick weather report because uh, it was snowing. This is at ABC7 News at 10. Um, I am here in downtown Midlothian. It is pouring snow accumulations up to 20 inches right now. We are experiencing some heavy snow. Heavy, heavy snow. We're going to be expecting over another two feet tonight. You know, just try to stay out. There's a lot of black, red, and white ice out here. Just watch out. You know, you don't want to be slipping. And here we have Brian Jason, a former runner at Brooklyn High School. How is this weather? You haven't had this weather since 1971. How is it to be, to be standing in this moment right now? It's pretty shocking. Um, it's April 5th, and it's snowing. It's like 40 degrees. It's pretty. I don't even know what to say about it. And we have Eric Oliva. What do you expect this summer to be like? Do you expect snow showers and cold and 30 degree weather? Or do you expect- Let me talk! Okay? I'm sorry, sir. Go ahead. Let me talk, okay? I'm expecting hella last snow this summer, okay? No summer body time, okay? You see this? This is four packs of muscle right here. Don't expect anything else, okay? All snow, all hail, no summer, no play. Right. Thank you very much, everyone. Uh, I'm reporting back to Anthony Juszczyk, AB7 Zooks. Hey, guys. Uh, we got Danny Mesa coming up with two uh, right behind him. He said he was going to pace it, but I don't know if that's going to happen. Danny Mesa coming up strong on the first lap. Will he keep his pace? We don't know. Looking good. Form's looking good. Getting those legs up. A nice pace, nice pace. He wants to aim for 70s average. We have Suave and Danny Mesa coming in here after 800. They look very well. As you can see, Suave's taking the lead. Danny is slowly trying to pass him up, but he is unsuccessful. Let's go, guys! Nice go, job! Let's go, guys. let's go! Here we have uh, Matt Loveridge and Angel Lopez. Angel seems to be taking the lead. But Matt is not letting go. Let's go, Matt. Let's go, Angel. Let's go, nice job, guys. As we have Mike Duda coming Let's go, Mike. in here. Let's go, Mike. Close that gap, Mike. Let's go. We have Danny Mesa coming in through the uh, 1,200. 
Let's go, Danny. One more, Danny. Let's go. Nice job. Nice job. As we see, Angel Lopez seems to be taking the lead, but Matt is not letting go. Matt Lovrich is hanging on. Angel Lopez is going. Angel Lopez is going. One more, one more. Matt is hanging on. Matt is hanging on. Just one more, Mike. One more lap after this. One more lap, Mike. Give me the best you can. Give me everything you can. Let's go. Mike Dunick is coming into the 1200. How does it feel, Elijah Trello, to be watching this great race? It, it's, As Danny Mesa is finishing, it, you're in the presence of a great runner here. Let me just say, it's the race of a lifetime. I'm not going to lie. We have two have proof pacing him for what could be potentially a PR. We don't know. You got a secret. Let's go, Danny. Let's go, Danny. Let's go, Danny. Let's go, Danny. Good job, Mike. I'm proud of you. All right, if you made it to the end of the vlog, I want to say thank you so much for watching. I'm planning to do more vlogs like this in the future for track and maybe cross country next year because I really like making videos and I also really like running. And even though I wasn't able to run today, I did have lots of fun. I hope my knee could get better soon so I could actually start running races because it really does suck not being able to run. I feel like I'm going to be horrible when I come back, but I'm going to try my best. I'm going to put in the work in the weight room and try to stay healthy somewhat. But like I said, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time and goodbye. Let's go, let's go. don't slow down. All right, I'm joined by uh, Musa Frauk. Uh, he just ran the two mile race. How was it? It was, it was great. Love the two mile. Was it really? It was absolutely great, except that fifth, sixth, and seventh lap. Oh man, was it really those great? were killers. No, it wasn't so great. I was I just, no, that wasn't great at all. all right. no. But you know what? That's why I love it. It hurts and I love it. Love the pain!